And she couldn't do that because the mother was so cruel. She said that the day that her mom died, she got into a room and she saw all the rituals that that woman did. It was pain in the door and all sorts of rituals. So she resented this woman so painfully in her heart. She never let go of that situation. And, you know, um, Jesus was saying to her that because she did not let go, although it was very painful, if you kill my mom, if you come near my family, I don't know. You know, so imagine that situation, killing her mom, the time that she needed her mom. I remember when I first had Darlene, oh my God, I woke up three days and, you know, it was so painful up here. And my mom was saying, put the butter on, and as soon as I put the shed butter on, you know, it just ease up the whole. Imagine if you can have a mother to tell you that simple thing that, you know, you can do in life. How painful. I was just going through that imagination without a mother. And you know, seeing that your mother has been killed, but God is saying, forgive. In a very, you know, bleak circumstance, God is saying, forgive and love that person. And this is the message that we've come with this morning. Amen. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 I want to hear you. Amen. Clap for my little know, praise and worship to you. I love you. That was powerful. And the option of praise and worship. Amen. Amen. That was too extreme. There are more to come. Amen. 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 It's Uncle Paul here, please. Uncle, if you can come in and read the um, scripture of the day for us. Woo! Amen. Not yourself, it is the gift of God. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Forgive me, um, I might be a little shy. I've not done this in a very long time. <laughs> um, okay, I'll invite uh, Uncle, sorry, Auntie Grace. To come and do that prayer for the nation. Amen. Watching TV or news, especially news, you see how blood shedding, people oh. are dying everywhere. And someone sent me a video which makes me so sad that when I'm watching, it was a, a, a mother carrying a, a baby behind her, and they were walking towards, I think they're going to fetch, fetch water. 
and um, they were ambushed by these rebels or whatever they call them, I don't know. But on their way, these people, you know, they, they, they just grabbed this mother with the little child behind her and they just shot them. You know, that I was so, so sad watching that. And I, to be honest, I still, I said, message sent to the person, I said, please don't send me this, this kind of uh, videos on WhatsApp because it's so hard to watch it. As, as a mother, watching your, your fellow woman killed right in front of a, a baby, you know. So I want us to stand on our feet and pray for not just Britain, all the nations, everywhere you look, there's, there's killing, people are suffering, children with no food, no mothers to look after them. So can we all stand on our feet, please? And the prayer is the nation will have peace and love one another. So that uh, God will, will intervene and rebuild our nations again. So can we all pray?